today was Trofeo Alcudia. It was like a hilly stage, but finished in a sprint. Quick step on the front. Now, I just want to talk about this lead out because Quick step are generally really good, but they messed up big time today and easily could have won. And the biggest thing here you'll notice they're not on one side of the road. They're on the, in the middle of the road, which is fine when you're going fast like this. And Cavagna's about to take over, which we'll see in a minute. And Cavagna's now on the front and he's drilling it. It's fine. 1.9k to go. But the issue is you'll see on the left, uh, EF is starting to move up. And on the right, you've got one T or Intermarche, whatever they're called. And the issue is, is that they can get swarmed on either side. If they want to go like... And then that means the person in the middle has got nowhere to go. Well, at least if you're on one side, the person who's swinging off may basically stop the other riders from moving out. And what you'll see now is that everyone's starting to move up. 1.9k to go. Quick step of running out of gas because Cavani has done um, quite a long turn. But now what you'll see is look at the left and the right. People are coming up on either side and their sprinter whose fourth wheel is now surrounded. He's boxed in Ethan Vernon. He can't get out. And now when these people start sprinting, uh, like EF and Intermarche, they're going way harder than what Cavani can do because he's just done a max effort. So he's got no way of responding. And the rider stuck behind him is then boxed in as well because they've already gone past him. So now where is uh, Ethan Werner? Now, we'll, we'll, you can spot Ethan Werner because he actually has to move up on his own. And he would have won the sprint, I'm convinced, if he had a proper lead out because it was a super technical finish. So if you look on the right-hand side of your screen now, you'll see Ethan Werner moving up. He's miles back. He's about eighth wheel now, moving up now on the right-hand side. Keep watching. He hops through the barrier under the tree. And now he's moved up to sort of third, fourth position. But you have to do a massive effort. You keep watching him now. And then if you compare that to like Vandenberg, who basically had an easy ride, uh, gets swarmed on the last corner, no stress because the UAE guy is going to give him a perfect lead out. So he's going really hard. Look at Ethan Burney. He's now fighting on the left-hand side in the wind continuously. And if Quick Step had just stayed on one side and managed to have that lead out uh, to actually dominate this, they would have easily won. Like, so easy. Because look at Gomai. He's Miles Mack. It was such a technical finish. You just have to be, like, very near the front. The corner was, like, with 50 metres to go. And Ethan Vernon is so quick, but still can't keep up with Vandenberg. So, yeah, basically, that was the big issue. Is Quick Step just did not protect uh, either side and they got swarmed by both and it's just so difficult when people start to come up either side the guy who's just swung off like who's doing the turn he's battered he can't go and do that thousand watts so you're really in a difficult situation where the and the person behind him is boxed in because he's got riders either side so yeah super difficult situation for quick step but anyway uh i think otherwise vernon probably would have won that easily so anyway just watching hope you enjoy it i'll see you in the next one